Hey guys, what's up? <clears throat> well, this is my 2009 MacBook Pro, and we're gonna upgrade it to an SSD drive today, because mechanical drives really suck. Now this does have a 500 gig mechanical in it, and we're gonna put in a 256 gig uh, crucial um, SSD. Can't remember, well, I guess it doesn't say, no, it doesn't actually say the speeds on this one. I don't remember the speeds, I've had this for a while, and uh, I honestly can't even remember where I got it from or why. But anyways, I have it nonetheless. So we're going to rip this sucker apart. And we're going to find out also how similar this thing is to uh, the 2012 MacBook Pro that I just put an SSD in. Now there are a couple of screws that are going to be different size. Okay, so to get this off, we want to just pry on the back in here. And just gently lift it up. Oh, got a little bit of dust bunnies. So we're going to have to clean those out. right back. Anybody for dollar store double-sided stickies? So. Programs, when they're running, will actually run much quicker, you know, just because of the SSD. Okay, so, GarageBand, one, two. Wow, doesn't take a lot of bounces to get that going now. So, first initial launch of a program might be a little slower, uh, but then when you go back into it again later, because stuff is held in memory until you release the memory, right? So, one and a half, <laughs> and it's ready to go. Alright, that's it. That's what we got for you today. So, that was our install. Um, I do believe I have a video on YouTube about using Carbon Copy uh, Cloner. Um, it's a really nice program. You can pay for it if you want. The trial version lasts you, I think it's either two weeks or a month or something. Um, but I mean, if you're only cloning your drive once and that's it, I mean, you really don't uh, need to keep it on your computer. Um, so what you do... Um, in this case, I'm not sure if it works the same way. We're about to find out, actually. Um, 
delete the backup task? Yes. No, don't check. So you gotta get to trial. Yes, 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 yes. And apparently we hold down option and uninstall CCC. Okay? Now, if you're not holding down option, it won't be there. This is how you completely uninstall the program. So you got to hold down the option key, highlight it, click. Are you sure you want to completely uninstall? Okay, now it says to remove created snapshots from the startup disk. Only snapshots on the disk that were created will be deleted. Snapshots on other volumes or snapshots from other apps are not affected. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so there's already a pre check mark in there, which means it's going to do it. Okay, so just say bye bye, and that's it, gone. If you just drag it to the trash, um, then it's not. It's going to leave pieces behind elsewhere in the OS. But by doing it that way, it's completely gone. Anyways, that's it. That's all. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And hey, we'll catch you in the next one. See ya.